Welcome back to another video. So made it out on the lake. Um, I fished this lake one other time, which was like summertime, so it was hot. And we didn't catch, we caught a couple, but not much. But um, I'm just gonna start out by these docks. There's only a couple docks left cause it's cold. It's literally 58, I think like 58 out right now. Not even, but we're gonna give this a shot. And my big motor won't start cause it's so cold out. And because it literally there was like ice on the boat this morning. That's how cold it was. So we're gonna give this a shot. Water temp is reading 57, so still decently warm. Starting out with the old Senko, just see if we can get bit. Um, I pulled out the lipless crank just in case I want to try moving bait, but I'm gonna slow myself down a lot just at first. There's one other guy out here. Say, is that already a bite? One other guy out here and he went right, so I'm just gonna. This says four and a half feet, or I guess four feet. Four, yeah, four, four and a half feet, so. Should've brought my sunglasses. I always forget to bring them, because I have to wear my other glasses. This time of year is all fish are feeding, fattening up for the winter. So you can still catch them. Especially on like moving baits, a lot of times they're this time of year to throw liplesses and stuff, but I, I like to try slowing down first before I start weaning that stuff around, but I might right here where there's no docks or anything really. I'm gonna pick it up. The old sexy shad. I may move out a little bit. These black maxes are honestly not bad. Especially for the price. I think they're like 70 bucks at Walmart. They might even be cheaper. I've had this rod for probably like five years now. And it still works perfectly fine. If you're trying to get a new bait caster and you're not really into bait casters, this one's a not a bad one. This is a seven foot medium heavy. It's a good rod. Is that a fish? No. Jesus. I was gonna say if it was a fish, you probably should have spit it out ten minutes ago when I was lifting it up. There's a bass right there. Not a big one, but big enough to catch. He's probably 12, 13 inches. A lot of times you can just reel these in, but you can also pop it so it kind of shoots up. So it's just constant reel, kind of, you can do a pop, 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 whatever you want. You can just change it up too. You just could cause a little reaction bite just by, and that, this one has a lot of rattles in it, so it makes those rattles go. Maybe there's a little creek coming in. Maybe there'll be a fish right there. I don't know how deep it is up there. That's a big one. Whatever that is, that's big. That's big, whatever it is. It's... I don't know what that is. That's a big bass. No way. It's a pike. Oh my. God. Get in here. Oh my gosh. 
What is wrong with it? Stop. Just stop. Just stop, please. It's pretty super skinny, but he's got a freaking head on him. I don't know what happened to his lip on this side. It's literally like flapping, but we'll get him back a little slime ball. There he goes. You guys can still see him right, maybe. He literally went right there and laid down. Or still like right there sitting there. Oh gosh. He was in inches of water. Oh, there he took off. Like when I say inches, like inches. I thought it was a giant bass. Cause he like almost blew up on it kind of, I don't know. That was sweet though. Hey guys, so I hope you guys enjoyed. That was my second time ever fishing this lake. And I fished just the other half that uh, I didn't fish the first time, but it was all right. I caught that one pike. I didn't have any other bites, but I was surprised I even caught that pike. That was literally in inches of water, but it's sweet that we caught something. Um, yeah, I want to fish this in the summer. Like I think, I don't remember if I fished it in the summer or it was like late summer. I don't know, but I want to try it when it's like, come on here when it's a good, actual good day. Cause I think last time it was hot where we, I think we swam most of the time. I don't even know if I made a video out of it, but yeah, that was, that was sweet. I'm glad I caught that pike. It was super skinny. Like, I don't know. And yeah, I thought, I, I was hoping it was a giant bass, but then I realized it was a pike and guess we'll take a slime ball but yeah I'm, i hope you guys enjoyed and please hit that subscribe button uh, yeah i'm happy about the 110 thank you for everybody that subscribed um new goal 200 let's hit 200 that's that'd be a huge accomplishment but um i hope you guys enjoyed and i'll catch you guys on the next one